Hi, I'm Chef Allen. Welcome to Allied Kitchen and Bath. We actually have a yellowtail here, which this year is being limited in the catch commercially so that we don't overfish it. When we overfish it, the population can't come back and then we lose out the, on the fish. And we don't want to lose out on varieties of fish. Okay, this is a yellowtail snapper. First off, you gotta make sure you've got fresh, fresh fish. Okay, with looking at fish, clear eye, the gut should be clean in the belly. Okay, this has been trimmed. We cut off the, the fins so it's nice and tight. So now what we have to do is the skin is, the skin is wonderful, it adds lots of flavor, and that's what we want to do is add to that. So I'm going to take a sharp knife and put some gouges in this, okay? Three gouges on that, and then again on this side, cutting through, cutting through on each one. After this is cooked, we're going to have these nice little fish steaks, which is going to be, really be wonderful. So here's what I'm going to do is stuff this fish with a lot of flavor. Okay, so the flavors that we're going to use is a couple of cinnamon sticks. Okay, along with that, I'm going to take a nice wedge of lemon. I'm going to put that in there. And then I've got some herbs to go in. Okay, so I've got a little bit of thyme. I've got some tarragon as well as some mint. Okay, so these are very aromatic. That's really what we want. We want these aromatics in the belly, okay, look at that, right in the belly. So that's gonna be our fish, so the flavors go inside. Now for the outside, what we're going to do, I'll put this aside, the same flavors, we're gonna take a little bit of thyme, so as you can see, you just rub your finger on that, that comes off, a little bit of mint, so you're gonna tear that, that mint right here, as well as a little bit of that tarragon, the same thing with the tarragon, you take your fingers and just Pull on the, the leaves so that you don't get the stem. The stem is a little bit hard to chew on and eat. So a couple more leaves of tarragon. Tarragon is sweet. The mint is sweet. The thyme adds some nice depth to it. So what we're going to do is take that and chop this up, roughly chopped. Okay, along with that, I'm going to take some garlic and just really fine, fine slices of garlic. I'm going to take one more set like that. Just, okay. Now I'm going to mix that all together. And this we're going to take, and we have these little slits in the fish. Now we're going to put the, going to stuff those slits with the herbs. So we've got the herbs in the belly. We've got the herbs on the outside. You've got lots of flavors going on. This thing seems to fall out, so we'll just cut him in half and get him in there on the belly because we like that flavor. Okay, here, going to season it. A little bit of salt and pepper. Turn him over again and get the other side too. Salt and pepper and a little bit of extra virgin olive oil here. So the secret to cooking fish, whole fish, with the skin on, is in the pan, okay? Pan has to be really hot. So I've been warming up this pan. It's a little bit oblong shape to hold the fish. I'm gonna just put a little bit of extra virgin olive oil in there. Okay, we've got the olive oil on the fish as well. And now we're gonna take that fish and place it in there. When you put the fish in, what you need to do also, high heat, and also just holding the fish down so it doesn't swelter on the bottom. So you wanna give a little bit of pressure with a spatula, just holding it, making sure that the whole fish is getting in there. Now after you've done that, even to the head, you want to give it a little bit of a shake. And a shake, there you go. We're going to turn that over in just a few moments. So with this, we're actually not going to finish it on the stove top because it's a whole fish. So what we're going to do is take this first off and turn it over. So I'm going to take this and turn it over now. Okay, 
skin still mostly intact, which is really what we want to do. Just drizzle with a little bit of olive oil on that. Moistens it a little bit. Okay, kind of brushing that around. And then what we're going to do is take this and put it into a 350 oven. So you're going to take the whole fish with the pan into a preheated 350 oven. This fish will probably take about 10 minutes to cook. Okay, so you, what you do is you sear it on both sides, then into the oven for about 10 minutes. It'll cook through to the bone, which is really what we want to do. When we take it out later, we're going to serve it with a great orange sauce. This orange citrus sauce with some olives and pine nuts can be delicious. I'm Chef Allen. Thanks. See you then.